K number 79. What is the volume? Okay, so it's our rotation one. So we're going to revolve y equals 2 plus sine of, sine of x from x equals x equals 5 about the x-axis. So I don't have my calculator on me, okay? But I do know, so you can get, your, you can get it on your calculator. You can draw it on your calculator. 5 is about here. But it's 2 plus the sine of x. So wherever I was at 0, I'm actually at 2. So it actually, the graph. would look something like this. And then they said x equals 0. That's the vertical line here. x equals 5 is the vertical line here. So remember, we always shade the region. So the region that we're looking at is this bugger. And we're going to revolve it about the x-axis. So we're going to do this. Okay. And so just for the sake of it, I'm going to put a disk in. Does everybody see that the disk doesn't have a hole in it? It's a solid. So that means we are going to use disk method. So always, when you identify that it's a disk method, write down the formula. Integral from a to b of pi times r squared dx. That's the formula. And then all you have to do is identify what each of the things are. What's a? Zero. Zero. What's b? Five. Five. And then now? What's R? Y. It's just Y. Can you write that like R is just equal to Y? Yeah. If you um, if they give it like this, it's correct because Y is assigned this value of this thing. I would tend to not to. If they give you a f of X or a G of X, absolutely. Okay. But technically, they should give you it. But that's the deal. Punch it in your calculator and you get it.